Hello everybody and welcome to a new episode of a PK commentary. So today we're going to be doing almost max strength. I haven't got a Berserker Helm and I've got Rune Gloves at the moment. But um, 118 quest points, we're getting there to bit Barrow's Gloves. So yeah, uh, using a Berserker Ring, uh, Fighter Torso and all that, Rune Defender. So we're going to be doing a DDS and D Mace. So hopefully we can get some good clips. I'm also going to be doing range to DDS and range to D Mace just to switch up a bit as well. So yeah, hopefully we can get some good clips, and I'll see you once I've found my first fight. So look what we've got here, a 1 defense pure, rune T3T over. So good luck to this guy. Really happy that we're fighting a 1 defense pure, because our DDS is going to rip through this guy. Hitting really well with the D skim, hitting 30s already. Wow, another 32, go for the DDS. Wow, just misclick there. Go for the DDS, oh, 25-5, not too bad. Could have killed him there on like 70 HP I think he was on. I'm not sure what our max is. I think it's like 36, 36. Go for the pot trick. DDS. Oh, 31, 33. Good fight, mate. Comes in with the wow. He's really surprised about that. Just got a 31, 33. No way we just hit that. Oh, my life. 31, 33. Our second DDS. Um, our second DDS that we've ever specced using Rune Defender and like D skim and stuff. That was absolutely mad. Good fight to that guy. So good luck to IT Aesthetic. Looks like he's a voider, so good luck to him. Turns on Smite, so that is a bit annoying. Going for the early DDS spec, 26-34, not too bad there. Left him on 25 hit points, so not too sure if I would have killed him or not. Would have to got like a like almost a max DDS spec to be honest. Going for another DDS spec and 0-0 zero, zero on 62 hit points. Probably could have killed him with a 31-31 there if we got some good RNG. And he's poisoned now, so that is quite good. And this guy is absolutely destroying us with his prayer. Almost getting smited for our B-ring. And put us on four prayer. Managed to uh, prep it up again. Almost a four. So really don't want to lose the B-ring. Oh, that would be a bit annoying to lose, like 3.5 mil. So we're uh, going for another DDS spec when he comes in for, for the Ballista. Because going to uh, Venge on the Ballista hit. There's Venge there going for the DDS. Oh, good fight, mate. Got that 38 Venge in there. Ballista PK, no way. Oh, my life. I just PK Ballista. Are you serious? No way. Got him with that 38 Venge there. I think that was like a 30 DDS spec in total. Just show my mate there the Ballista. No way we just PK Ballista off that guy. That guy had Smite on, so how, how did that happen? Did he not have Protect Item on or something? That is weird. How we just PK the Ballista? No way. That is a perfect clip. That was like a 70 stack. And got the Ballista PK. Good fight to that guy. DDS is so OP for me. So Mr. Hulk 420 is our new target here. Using range in Rune Plate Legs and Rune Kite Shield. So he's got quite a lot of defense bonus. So hopefully we can still uh, rip him with our DDS. Comes in for the DDS there. 0 16. 9 16 again. He's going to triple spec. We're going to go in for the Venger on his next DDS spec. Oh, 0-14, and he hit us at 0-0 with his DDS on our Venge. So we could have easily killed him if we'd have got a, uh, if he just hit us on our Vengeance and we would, we would have specced anything big, then we could have easily got the kill there. So we've got two specs left, going for the uh, DDS again, 0-28. Could have easily killed him there, left him on like 10 hit points. We absolutely wrecking this guy, but our DDS isn't hitting. And 20, followed by a 4. Bit of a waste there because he was like 65 hit points, so would have had to almost get a max spec to kill him. So looks like we're gonna have to get in with our Venge to get a kill. So we're gonna take off our legs and Venge on the next crossbow hit. And he's dead! Good fight, mate! 25 followed by the 27. Perfect vengeance there. So decided to pull out the G more, see if we can get any good hits with the DDS to G more. So good luck to our friend here, Drago. I know that he's using knives to AGS. So I know that that's really overpowered. So hopefully we don't die from that. So uh, he's coming in for the whack there. Whack was a zero on like 66. So not going to die to a spec there. He's coming in for the edge, yes. And the more, 0, 25. Could have easily died there. Left us on like 40 hit points. So not sure how we did not die there to be honest. Hit a zero with the more and a noodle AGS. So uh, hopefully we won't die now from any whacks. And hopefully we can get the kill with the uh, DDS to Granite more. So just going to super strength again there. Going in for the DDS there. And the G-more. Good fight bro. 25-11. Followed by the 35 G-more. 
absolutely overpowered that gym wall was there. 35, don't normally hit anything higher than that. So I guess that's just good RNG on our part. Tier 3 PK as well and an emblem. So quite good loot there. Got up to the tier 2. So good fight to our friend there. So Kamikaze Kid is our new target. Decided to pull out range and DDS and uh, switch in with the Rune Defender. So doing a two-way switch. Ah, oh, comes in with a nice vid. Thanks a lot, man. Just going to attack here. I don't really mind. I, doesn't think, I don't think he's ready. So just going to wait for him to pot up and then we'll attack him. So this guy's four combats below us, so uh, we've got quite a few stats on him. 70 attack, 85 strength. So uh, quite nice stats to be honest. So hopefully we can get a nice range to DDS combo. Oh, his range hits are absolutely terrible. Just hitting so many zeros, even though I'm prayer switching. Come on, that's a good hit there. Going for the DDS. Oh, 10-33, good fight bro. I think that was a 10 range hit and then went in for the DDS there. Got the 10-33. Quite a nice switch there as well. Haven't really used this much to be honest. So I remember it being quite hard. When I first got the Rune Defender I tried it out. And it was like quite hard to do a two way switch. But yeah getting the hang of it now. Quite a nice kill there. Nice 10-33 to start it off. So me and my mate just tried to score trip this guy. But we failed and he didn't fall for it. So uh, he's a bit annoyed about that. And we just poked a 7. We are so bad. That was really embarrassing. Poking a 7 on like 30 hit points. So uh, hopefully we don't do that again. Going for the pot trick. And we just poked again. He's going in for the AGS. A 26. Oh, followed by the more. Really delayed there. Wax us a 0 with the more. Going in for the DDS there. Ah, oh, 0 on 52. He also spec a 0 on our Venge. Sorry, whacked a 0 on our Venge. Going to go in for the DDS. 0, 34. Could have easily killed him there. Left him on 11 hit points. Not sure how he's alive, to be honest. Ah, oh, 0, 4 on 49 hit points. And a 0 17. Ah, oh, this guy is so lucky. We expect so many noodle hits on his hit points. So, gonna have to go in for another Venge kill like we did before. Going in for the whack there. Wax was a 7. Not gonna die on 67 HP to a uh, AGS whack. So, gonna have to get the Venge in quite soon. And he's dead. Good fight, bro. Got him with the 30 D skin whack, followed by the 15 Venge with the legs takeoff. Really like getting the, those kills, they feel so nice getting the uh, one tick, venge and rune plate legs off because they don't even see it coming. So yeah, good fight to him, nice venge kill there and sorry for score tricking you but I just had to do it, even though we failed. I've got no clue what my target's doing, um, just going to ask this guy to fight us, Devo King. Hopefully he fights us because my target is just standing out there, really annoying and he's not going to skip either, he's just going to stand there. So uh, I guess it's good luck to this guy, going for the DDS, oh 3117, we just literally two hit that guy, good fight bro, this guy here saying lol, shout out to you as well, saying uh, nice vids, so yeah, uh, vidded that, definitely, that was an amazing clip, literally two hit that guy, really feel sorry for him there, got him with the 3117 after like that 35D skin, absolutely wrecked that guy, feel really bad for him because he seemed like a bit of a noob. Not sure what gloves he had or wasn't really looking, but uh, he didn't even have a fire cape. Um, so yeah, good fight to him. So decided to pull out the D-Mace and range with Rune Defender. So doing a two-way switch here. My mate said that the max that he's hit with a D-Mace is 57. And his a maxed uh, Zerka. His name's a good look, I'm Zerk. So yeah, uh, hopefully we can hit some good hits. I'm pretty sure I can hit like a 50, 51. Pretty sure that's the max hit with... Uh, Without Barrow's Gloves and 92 Strength with the Rune Gloves. So yeah, as I said before, almost at Barrow's Gloves, not too far away. So we're uh, pretty confident that I'm not going to die to this guy because he can't one tick, so I can always get the eat in. And this guy has been really annoying running behind the trees. So uh, hopefully we can get some good hits. Still got three specs to go, so I uh, need to use them quite quickly. Got to go in for it there, he's got to be dead. And good fight bro, 22-36. That was really weird. For some reason, I got like a 96 XP drop, but I just hit a 36 with the D Mace. That was really weird. I'm not sure what was going on there. That's why I didn't really react when I saw a 96 XP drop. So, uh, yeah, good fight to him. That was a pretty nice kill. 22 36. Again, a 46, sorry, 56 stack in there. Sorry, 58 stack. My maths is terrible. But yeah, a nice kill there. So, uh, someone wants to comment below telling me why I only hit a 96 XP drop. Uh, that was a bit weird, I'm not sure why that happened. But yeah, good fight to that guy. Nice 36 D Mace there. So good luck to Murder7. This guy's almost max MSB AGS Zerka. He's got 75 attack, 
95 strength and uh, 99 range. So our odds of killing this guy are pretty low to be honest. And this guy is, oh he's coming for the edge, yes! Oh 36 and left us on 36 hit points. So would have had to got a 66 um, AGS, which I don't think he would have been able to hit. I'm not quite sure. 41 AGS there. I think we got the pit eat in there. Saying like, what the hell? Is like really surprised that I uh, survived that because I did get the pit eat in there. That's why I survived. So uh, a bit lucky on our part. Oh wow, he just whacked us at 14. We could have easily died. Gonna go in for it there. Oh, 21 44. GG, bro. The D mace yet again coming in with the kill. Uh, shows how much D Mace is better than AGS. It's so much more fun using D Mace and AGS because when you're killing people who are maxed uh, Zerkers using AGS, and you kill them with a uh, you kill them with a D Mace and they're using AGS, then that's just got to be so embarrassing. But yeah, good fight to him. D Mace is so OP. So decided to pull out the uh, G Maul so we can hopefully get some nice Insta G Maul specs to DDS specs. So uh, we'll see how that goes. So as you can see, this guy's 75 attack. So I need to watch out for that AGS. Going for the Inspector DDS. Oh, how is he not dead? 0.21 left him on. 23 hit points, I think it was. Going for our second spec. 0.19 there. Have no clue how this guy is alive. So we've basically got no way of killing him. He's got two AGS specs and all we've got is Venge. He's AGS in us there. 0 on 56. Really lucky that I survived that. Like I, I don't know why I did not eat. I just stood there on uh, 56 hit points and just hoped that he wouldn't hit us. So, um, oh, this guy's wrecking us with his D-skim and a 0 on 72. Just going to have to wait till the AGS specs and hopefully get a nice Venge combo in. Because uh, he was like 3 ticking his AGS, so hopefully we can get the Venge in on uh, that AGS spec. So, uh, none of us are hitting anything. He's going in for the AGS. Oh, good fight, bro. Got that nice Venge in there. Whacked us a 46. That was like almost max. Then I uh, got the 36 Venge on him. 179k cash, are oh, so much. So yeah, he comes in with the lol as well, so obviously not very happy that we got the Venge in there. Probably a bit annoyed that he died to someone using uh, DDS, even though he was like three combats higher than us. So good fight to him nevertheless. So we've got this C9RL guy as our target. As you can see, he's a Void up with 45 defense. So hopefully our D skim will absolutely rip through this Voider. So we're going to DDS spec him as soon as he gets on to like 60 hit points. And how are we alive? He just uh, rune crossbowed us a 0 on 23 hit points. So, so lucky that we are alive there. Oh, when he ballista uh, specs us a 48 on 50 hit points. I still don't know how we are alive. So we've got 3 food left and all we've done is 15 damage on this guy. Shows how uh, good Void is. Going for the DDS. Oh, 0 10 on 63. How is he alive? Going for the DDS again, 0-34. Got no clue how both of us are alive. We we should both be dead, to be honest. Going for the DDS again. Ah, oh, 0, zero and he hit a 0 on our Venge. So we could have easily died if both of us had hit something. So going to win for the last DDS spec there. Oh, good fight, bro. 10-33. Really nice XP drop there. I'm pretty sure that, that DDS spec would have been a lot higher if he was higher hit points. So good fight to him. Nice 10-33 uh, there. As you, as you saw, that void absolutely wrecked us. We were out of food. Sorry, we had three food left. And all we'd done was 15 damage on him. So that guy's account was like really strong. So yeah, good fight to him anyway. Nice 10-33. So decided to pull out the DeLong here. See what we can hit with it. As uh, we haven't used that yet. I decided to pull out the G Maul as well. Just to help it out a bit. Because the DeLong can't really hit that much. It's put, I'm pretty sure it's like 10 less than the D Mace. So uh, it's got the G Maul just to help it out a bit as well. So this guy is 75 attack as well, so I'm pretty sure he's got an AGS. So we need to watch out for that when he comes in for it. So uh, hopefully we can get a Venge combo in here as well. Oh, it's got to be dead! Good fight, bro! 36 D long followed by the... Uh, I think that was a 12 more. So good fight to him. Wasn't expecting to get the kill there. Shout out to you as well, mate. Um, glad you enjoyed the vids. So a uh, really nice combo there. Got the Venge combo. He hit us on our Venge, and we got a 36 D-Long, followed by a 12 Granite Maul. So, uh, really nice uh, spec there. I've been spending so long trying to get a D-Long to g Maul spec uh, kill, and as you can see, as you just saw, I finally got the kill. It's literally been like an hour or so, so uh, really happy to get that. Wasn't too big of a hit, but uh, it was still quite a nice kill. So, good fight to him, nevertheless. So pulled out range to um, D-Mace and Rune Defender again, so doing the two-way switch. 
Got a voider here, Kaifu. So uh, that's quite good because the DMAs can hopefully hit through the um, void because it hasn't got that much of a defense bonus. So we're going to see what we can hear. Got to go in for it there. Oh, good fight, bro. Just four hit that guy as if we just destroyed that guy so much. I mean, our range was seriously over overpowered there. Got like a 20 followed by a 21. So had to go in for the D-Mace spec as we were, as he was on like 35 hit points and then we got the 35 D-Mace. So yeah, uh, I'd say I was quite lucky because we did get some really good range hits. But really nice, really nice kill there. Um, D-Mace is so overpowered to be honest. So good luck to Bajern. Looks like he's a maxed 1 defense uh, AGS pure with 99 strength and 99 range. So going in for the DDS there. Oh, how is he not dead? 24, 35. How is this guy not dead? Going in for the third spec. Good fight, bro. 16, 28 there. That spec was actually way higher than it actually uh, showed up because it was 348 XP drop. So that was like a 30, 28 or something like that. So yeah, sorry for 3 specking you, bro. I know that is a terrible honor, but uh, I just wanted to get the kill. Red barred you twice in a row. Uh, really sorry um, for three spec in there. I know that's like really terrible to do in the game, but um, I don't really care. Just wanted to get the kill. And uh, as you are one defense DDS Rambo's old Zerkers who are um, using DDS absolutely Rambo against people with one defense. So just wanted to see what it was like. So we're literally almost out now. Just hanging on to survive because in like five seconds we get our spec. And we're going to go in for it. We've got the spec. He's got to be dead. Oh, good fight, bro. 32. GG, bro. I had to wait for the spec there. We uh, drank all the brews and then managed to uh, pop back up after that. So, yeah, got the kill there. The 32 D mace. We spec four zeros earlier on in the fight. But we managed to hang on and wait for the fifth spec after it restored. So, yeah, good fight to him. 32 D mace. Hey guys, so I really hope you enjoyed that uh, PK commentary. I really enjoyed it using DDS and D-Mace and then that one D-Long clip. I'm really, really enjoying using 60 attack weapons. So much more fun than AGS. Like, everyone kept telling me to uh, make a 60 attack pure or do some 60 attack content on my channel. So I decided to do it and I've had so much fun doing it. So I really hope you enjoyed it as well. I'll be definitely doing more 60 attack content as it's so much more fun than AGS. So well, I think I'm going to be doing a road the uh, episode 3 of Road to 100 tier 10s. I might use 60 attack weapons in that um, video, but I might only get like 1 to 2 tier 10s. Because it's a lot harder and it takes a lot longer to get kills using the 60 attack weapons. But it's so much more fun when you do. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a like if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one.